In a unanimous ruling, the London-based Privy Council has dismissed a challenge by the Public Services Association, PSA, of the ongoing operationalization of the Revenue Authority, TTRA. The five law lords who presided over the appeal of customs, Officer Teresa Dore, were expected to deliver their decision at the beginning of October. However, in a written ruling on September 16th, the judges unanimously dismissed the appellant's appeal. Justice Westman James initially rejected Dore's challenge in November 2013. On May 28th, Justices of Appeal Nolan Burroughs, Charmaine Pemberton, and Mira Dean Armourer also did the same. In the lawsuit, Dore challenged the constitutional validity of the Revenue Act 2021. Dore contended that Section 18 was unconstitutional as it sought to interfere with the terms and conditions of employment of public servants currently assigned to the SED and IRD. The section gave public servants some 1,200 three months to decide on their future employment on the operationalization of the TTRA. Those affected had the choice to resign from the public service, accept a transfer to the TTRA or be transferred to another office in the public service. The implementation was initially expected to take place in August 2023, but was deferred by Finance Minister Colm Imbert to December 2023 based on the case. It was subsequently deferred to March 2024 to facilitate the PSA's legal challenges. Dore also claimed the government did not have the power to delegate its tax revenue collection duties. In their ruling, Lords Reed, Lloyd-Jones, Burroughs, Stevens, and Lady Simler held that the TTRA Act did not breach the Constitution.